Hey everybody, Brad May here, former Vancouver Canuck, two times. Um, I only touch greatness. I will be on the show because you know what? I have a little greatness to my story as well. And um, I just want to enjoy the conversation with Ryan and um, tune in and let's get after it. Can I ask, uh, we can always edit this part out if you feel free not to answer it. What about the Steve Moore thing? Um, you know what? I can tell you everything I feel about the Steve Moore thing. I think, because quite honestly, first of all, the, you know, lawsuit, the, the civil lawsuit is over, right? So um, it's been settled, it'd be whatever. So it's gone. I don't like Steve Moore as far as I could throw him. Um, he sued me too. I, I, got, I scored two goals at 50, 47 penalty minutes or 51 penalty minutes in a game. I played five minutes of ice time. We lost that game against Colorado that night. But it was the best game of my career. And, and that whole thing, I, I'm being a smart ass now, um, it overshadowed what, what, what happened. Steve Moore, I'm, gl I'm glad he's okay. Uh, nobody wants to see anybody injured. So it's not like I don't respect him or, or I'm not compassionate to it. My buddy's Todd Bertuzzi. We make mistakes. We'd love to have that one back for sure. Um, did Steve Moore deserve to be punched in the head? 100%. Did yeah. he deserve to be punched in the head? 15 times. I'll tell you yep. what, the game of hockey deserved to be punched in the head as many times as it took. To get the point, and, you don't run your fucking captain. And so, so uh, I'm, I'm right there. Does, when, you get, when you get hit now, what, the way it was done, I feel terrible the way it happened for my buddy Todd. I feel awful for Steve Moore. I really do. But he sued me too. I had to go to court in Denver two years later. Um, I think this guy is the biggest fraud ever. He's not, he wasn't as injured as, as what he led on to believe. And he doesn't deserve millions of dollars. However, the courts believe so. And there was a settlement. So, you know what? I hope he's enjoying his money. He's never played the game again. He could have. It's an it's a absolute crock of shit if, if he says he couldn't, because I guarantee he could have. Um, all of that being said, I think, that, I think it sucks. I, I could get even deeper and tell you exactly yeah. what I'm thinking. But the truth is, I played with his, his younger brother years later in Toronto. Yeah. Um, a, a very nice family. I don't know Steve, so I don't, really, I don't care to ever I – don't, I don't ever want to meet him. But if I did, I'm sure he'd be a nice guy, and I don't – so I have no personal attachment to it. I just think it, it changed professional sports, maybe for the better. I don't know. Um, all of this stuff, because you professional mean, sports – He took it off the ice. He took it off well, the ice. You, it was an awful image that we all still have. Yeah. It's, it's now a professional athlete can be litigious and, and, and can sue the guy across from him. I guess maybe that was always available to, to the player, but it never really happened. Um, it, ch it changed the landscape. Is that a good thing? You know what? None of us want to see somebody being stretchered off the ice. I, I believe that. Nobody wants to see that. So the whole thing, um, too much yeah. emotion, too much raw emotion around it. But I can tell you, that to finish everything I had to say, um, Todd Bertu is a good buddy. I know he made a mistake and he did the wrong thing at that time, 100%. Did Steve Moore deserve to get, take a beating or fight for himself? Forget a beating. Did why, he deserve did he stand, why didn't he yeah. stand up for himself? That's my question. And you know what? He didn't. And anybody that tells you that he fought Matt Cook earlier in that game and that actually settles all scores doesn't know or didn't know the game of hockey and the, and the, and the mentality that we had back then. Um, were we wrong? I don't know. I'm not a player anymore, so I can say whatever I want. I don't like him. I don't. I love his. I love his brother, and I met his family. They're wonderful people. Um, yeah, that's it. Yeah, I 